To create this style, I'm going to be doing a side part. To know the point of starting the side part, I'm using the arch of an eyebrow as my starting point. Now the part is only going to be about 3 or so inches long. After creating the part, I'm sectioning the hair into 3 sections in front. So that will be what I'm going to use as my starting braid. And all you just do is start corn growing. Now I'm grabbing here only from the sides. I'm not grabbing here from the center. As I grab the hair from the side, I'm joining it with the outer strand that is crossing to make the corn roll. As you can see, it's getting really big. So you want to have a good handle on it when you're braiding because yes, this is a jumbo braid. So grabbing hair again from one side and this is the side of the part that we did I'm joining it into the center and then gently conroing the hair I'm repeating that again grabbing hair from the side one side and then also I will proceed to also grab hair from the other side make sure that as you grab the hair you don't want to grab too much and you also don't want to grab too little of the hair so just continue doing your con roll as usual and if you don't know how to con roll you can do that um, by clicking the button that is going to come up right now and that will teach you how to con roll so sometimes you might get small pieces of hair all you just do is just curl that to the middle section and grab some more hair to add to the little part of that braid So once done with the corn roll, you just want to braid as normal. Now when you finish braiding the hair, this is where we're going to do our pin curl. All you do in this section is just wrap the pin, the end of the hair around on top of the corn roll that you just did. Get your bobby pin or hair pin and secure the hair. I'm going to secure it two times just to make sure that the hair doesn't come loose. After doing this, I'm just going to control our edges just to lay them down. I'm spritzing a little bit of water using my um, moisturizer. I'm using the Obier Curl Defining Custard. I think that's the name. <laughs> and I'm just using a soft bristle brush to just brush the edges together. And that's all we do. And I hope you like this style. The last step is to accessorize the hair. We do hope you like this style. Don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to visit our other channel, DN Vlogs Live. Bye! Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, right? Mm -hmm. Seven, eleven tens, you said it.